Who's that? Da na na na, da na 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 na. Guys, welcome. I'm Joe. I play video games after work, and uh, I do live streams every Friday and Saturday between 8 p.m. Eastern and midnight. You can find me here on Twitch, and you can also find me over on YouTube.com slash Joe After Work. That's where all my content goes, so even the full versions of the live streams, I do breakdown videos for, so... Um I know I don't have a Graceful Explosion machine, machine theme set up for tonight, but going forward, if we continue with this game, I will be sure to fix that theme going forward. Um, we're going to play a little bit of this for the next 30, 45 minutes, and then we're going to jump back into our main series, which is I Am Setsuna. It's a JRPG from Square Enix and Tokyo, Tokyo RPG Factory. So without further ado, let's get into this right now. Uh, I guess we just plus simple as pressing play is that what's going on <clears throat> Clee Clee baby how you doing switchception <laughs> What do you call a titan that can't swim What the hell aliens invading Oh I have to press A every time okay Oh boy Magentos Prime Galaxy Map, so zero of nine levels complete. Okay. Huh. Alright, so let's go through this. Let's see what this is exactly. <clears throat> Alright. Oh, side scrolling shooters. I'm feeling Gradius right now. Okay. ZL to flip. All right. I'm feeling a little, um, what is it? What? Uh, I can't remember the game. It's a pixel junk game. Like, all those pixel junk games. I feel like that's what this is right now. Okay. And then I'm guessing ZL to switch back. Yes. Okay. See what you did there, Nintendo. You got me switching back and forth. The walls are shifting. The, these cave systems, they loop around? Oh, man. They're going crazy right now. Phase complete. Oh, okay, and it gives you the list of phases. <clears throat> A new one. Energy sword. Close range, 360 attack, and also destroy enemy bullets. Okay. And then I can still... Oh, so that's like my special? Is that what that does? Yep. I see it. I got a little meter up on top. It seems like. Or is it the meter on the bottom? Is that what it is? Yep. No! I pressed Y. All right, jerks. All right, restart from phase two. Oh, and there's a life system. Oh, great, fantastic. Real nice, real nice. CB, what's going on? Oh, man. Oh, God, it's Klee. She sunk my fries deeper? What? I have no idea what just happened. Oh, and no power. All right, so how do we regain power? The yellow energy. Okay, we're learning. We're learning as we're going. Capture card skipping around like that? I don't know. Can't tell if that's a switch or if that's a capture card. I think it's a capture card. Okay, we're good again though. Oh gosh. Uh... Oh gosh. There we go. Got it. Yay! <laughs> Okay, this is going to be one of those games that I'm going to get easily infuriated by when I start dying like crazy. 1-2. Alright. I'm going to catch up with the chat here while I'm doing this. Or trying to. That might be... That might not be the smartest idea, Joe. Might not be one of the greatest ideas 
that you have come up with. Oh boy. I pressed Y, you jerk. Alright. Man, this is a game that's gonna require some serious focus. That's <laughs> that's all I gotta say about that. Oh, so the meter up on top is my laser, and then, okay, I got you now. So if that laser keeps going up, oh, I didn't even realize the map up on top, what? Okay. Red dots are enemies, of course, that makes sense. That was a health up, I think? Yes, what did we get? Sniper beam. Uh-oh. Long-range precision laser beam. Extra damage when focused. Look at the damage on this. Jeez. That's a sniper beam. Oh, I just hold on. To oh, okay. I'll take it. Oh, gosh. There we go. Nice. Oh, man. Klee asking, how is everybody doing tonight? Dashing. Dash through enemies without taking damage. Oh, CR to dash, okay. And of course they made me use up a freaking thing. Ah, okay, so can I not switch between the sword and the sniper beam? Oh, man. All right, after this level, we will catch up with the chat. Here we go. And... Burn! Space worms! I don't know why, but the first thing I think of when I see this animation is Futurama. <laughs> I have no idea why, because the art style doesn't really remotely <laughs> resemble Futurama. But I think it's, maybe it's the spaceship. I think it's the spaceship. That's why. I think the spaceship is the reason why I'm thinking Futurama. It totally feels like I'm on that ship. Oh gosh. There we go. Yeah, I can totally see myself killing an entire train ride. Just trying to go through a couple stages of this game. Easy. Oh, come on, dude. There we go. Ah! Yeah, damn it. Yeah, damn it, kid it. Kid it. Kid the worms. Kid the space worms. Yeah, damn it. Oh, there's a weapon. Oh, crappies. Oh, no. There we go. Oh no, lifesaver, okay. That was just life. How do I switch? There's more over here! Okay, didn't catch that. Didn't get that memo. Oh, I'm gonna die, aren't I? Alright, alright. Come on. Ah, no! Ah! <laughs> Oh man, this game feels trippy, Cookie says. Yes. I I can definitely I can definitely see why you would think that for sure. There's like a there's a lot going on on this screen. Oh. I feel like it's cutting a bit. That might just be my capture card. Hold on. It's def I'm definitely getting some jitters right now. And there we go. Boom. Oh. Okay, that does feel a little bit better. Maybe it was just my capture card. I hope so. I'd be ashamed if it was the game. Ooh. There we go. Come on. Um, I'm trying to, like, read. 
<laughs> the chat as I'm going, but there's always like a horde of enemies on the screen at all times. It's crazy. Boom. Alright. I'm just gonna save the beam for that. I wanna know how the hell to switch weapons. No? I guess. I guess once you. I, we had the energy beam before, the, the sword beam, or whatever the hell. Oh gosh. You know what this kind of I I'm also thinking geometry wars in the realm of that. In terms of like there's always just enemies spawning everywhere. Except in geometry wars, I think it was just like constant horde mode basically. Oh nice, we're almost there. Enemies left. Nice. I like that it gives me that indication. Kind of feels like I'm like almost there. Not really. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, you jerk. Alright. Uh. I do not like those guys. Oh gosh. Boom. Beautiful. Alright. Completed the level. Woo! <laughs> Bam, hits taken seven, jeez. That didn't feel like four minutes. That definitely did not feel, I, that felt longer. It's weird, that happens when I edit videos too. I'm like, oh, I spent way too long. But it's only like, I only spent the minute like repeating a level. <laughs> oh man. So what's going on in chat? Sorry, I, I couldn't even focus on that. <laughs> 67 UK says, what is that square triangle? Oh, fish. <laughs> nice. C Joe is out. C Joe is lurking in the stream, so you can see a wild C Joe. I need you to put as many fish on the screen as possible. I don't even know if that's possible on Twitch. <laughs> oh my goodness. What shrooms have we been taking? <laughs> oh no, Emily wants to play. I'm uh, waiting Joe to play Has Been Heroes on the Train. <laughs> I have played it on the train. Oh man, Joe Cartman. God damn it! God damn it! Get it! Get it! Get it. That, that's my pie, kitty. That is my pie. Don't you touch my pie, kitty. Beat me! I want to be in the sweet. <laughs> Wasn't there an episode where Cartman was waiting for the Wii U to come out forever, and then he went too far into the future, <laughs> got frozen there? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. It was some console that he was waiting for and he couldn't wait so he tried to freeze himself and it ended up in the future. <laughs> oh man, Klee says Breath of the Wild, I'm really enjoying it so far. Dude, oh my god. Such a good game. Are you playing it on Switch or on Wii U? Oh, that is, oh my god. I can't get enough of that game, dude. I actually haven't gone back in like a week and a half, but this weekend... As soon as I get off stream, I'm probably going to start playing because I, I want to finish getting all the shrines. I don't know if that's something that you guys are interested in seeing, uh, just me hunting for shrines, but that's what I do. Uh, that's what I want to start doing again on my off time because that's all I was doing leading up to the uh, story stuff that we were doing on the streams. Oh, man. What else? What did we miss here? What did we miss here? My boy Joe looked like he gained some weight since I last saw him. <laughs> Send the loot. What is going on? Oh, man. Feeling fatter every day. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Sonic Master, what's going on? Pew, pew, pews. Oh, my goodness. The family is here today. Family is strong, both on YouTube and on Twitch, man. I'm loving it. Wii U. Dude, hey, it's all good. It, it's... It, you can barely tell the difference between Wii U and Switch. No worry, you're good. <laughs> that, and you could still play it on the gamepad. So there, I call that a win. Joe, did you see my upload speed? Dude, that upload speed is serious. That is speeds not even remotely close to what I have at all. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Don't kill it! No, Deadeye! 
Is that why is that why the streams always crash? You guys are killing the YouTube chats? 67 UK, they're coming for you. They're coming for you, 67. You better watch out. Oh man, we got 12 people up in here. What the hell is going on? Oh my goodness. Guys. Once again, I want to thank everybody that's been hosting. Jamily, CB, Zomber, Santa Destroyer, Ruby, Klee, Zero, and uh I oh I think I said True Pretty Tony. Sorry. <laughs> True Pretty Tony again. Oh my goodness. Alrighty, guys. Here we go. We're gonna go jump into the next one. We'll do a couple more stages of this, and then we'll continue on to I Am Setsuna. But, uh, here we go. Let's go level 1-3. Let's see how painful this will be for my face missiles. Here we go. That's more my style. Tap for burst fire. Hold. Continue. Firing left stick to direct missiles. Oh yes. What? Oh no, I need I need to stock up. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Nice. Okay. I like these power-ups. I, I'm digging it. Uh, how do I zoom again? It was R. It was R. Wrong one. Oh, and my dash recharge is awesome. Hell to the yes. Boom. Beautiful. Oh, I hit. I was holding on to X. Not realizing that I had uh, nothing left in the tank. Boom. Here we go. Here we go. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, no, 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 no. That was my bad. Yeah, I don't think... I don't think it's my capture card that's... I don't know if you guys are seeing it. But it's like skipping as there's more enemies on the screen. I, I don't think it could handle the amount of enemies on screen. I don't think that I just refreshed my capture card. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. I'm going to have to play this offline to figure out if that's the amount of characters that are on the screen right now. Causing it to skip like that. Uh uh nope, I'm pressing wrong buttons. Here we go. What I'm really enjoying about the Switch so far is all these little indie games that that I've been playing so far have like a com a unique control style to it. Like, even, I'm gonna lump in Has Been Heroes with that as well, because it's got at least, I, I, it had that going for it to me, to be honest. I was like, oh, I like this. I like this control style. It took me a little bit getting used to, but once, once you got there, it clicks and it works for that gameplay. Here while I try to save my life right now. There we go. Phase two complete. Oh gosh. I'm digging the music in the background too. Beautiful. 
Woo, phase three, let's do this. I was so lost, I had no idea what I was doing, but oh, and I got died. I got died? <laughs> I almost died. There we go. Come on, give me health. Yeah, that's sort of the glory of like Legend of Zelda games in general that have that somewhat open world aspect, but this one is definitely a full on open world experience, which I thoroughly enjoy. And um, this one definitely sticks true to like just exploration and being able, it's like, it's, it takes away a lot of the rules of previous Zelda games. I totally die. No, I didn't die. Okay. Which is what I love so much about it is they took away a lot of like the Legend of Zelda tropes and just they revamped the title basically. It's like, here we go. Here's, here's a fresh Zelda experience and you can start anywhere you want. All right, here we go. We'll start from phase three. Boom, let's go. Woo! Yeah, hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh! Okay, no, it's okay, Joe. It's okay, Joe, Joe. Let's do this. Missiles. Yeah, once you start getting the hang of it. It just kind of clicks, and then you're like, oh, okay, I got this now. I got the hang of it. I'm good to go. Oh, man. Jeez. It's like seeing all these... All these games coming out this year is like really making me excited even more so for E3. Like I'm really excited that I'm that I was able to like have money saved for a ticket for that. Like I wasn't even expecting to be able to um what you call it to like go to an E3 ever and then when the opportunity <laughs> popped up and it was like, "Hey, this year it's like for everybody. You don't have to be like a retailer to get like a special car because that's usually what it's for it's for industry industry folks and whatnot like a person like me is not supposed to be there enjoying it it's supposed to be like showing games that are coming out and like showcasing it to retailers and business people and yada 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 and journalists and stuff so that's gonna be freaking awesome i can't wait to record some of my experiences out there and i just like i i want to do a video for what i'm expecting at nintendo to start announcing um but I kind of want to do it for, like, all three companies. I mean, you know, I still play my other console games. Um, I just don't play them on here, but I do play them. And I... E3 in general is just always an exciting time because it goes E3, then you get Gamescom, and then you get TGS, and then that leads into... Um, uh, PlayStation experience in in December and it, it's just like all like gaming season starting in June and it just keeps going heavy but uh, and then you have like games coming out during what's usually considered the slower season uh, June February April um, sorry I missed out March like all these freaking top tier games coming out and it's just insane my jaw dropped when I saw the Temple of Time. Dude, when I saw the Temple of Time pop up for the first time, uh, when I played it at the NYC event, I was like, because that was the first time I looked at anything Breath of the Wild when, when I got to play it there. I know that they showed they showed off a lot of stuff on the 24-hour uh, stream of Nintendo stuff during E3 last year, and I wanted nothing to do with it. I was like, nope, staying away from this. And, dude... Oh my god. I was like in awe. That whole field, the whole Grand Plateau was like, are you serious right now? This game is just out of... The stuff that you're going to experience and the stuff that you're not going to find that you find out from someone else telling you is unreal. It's, it's just crazy. I'm still learning things about like certain things that just happen 
Like, me and L1 Metal Gaming and uh, Ha Ha are all like, every time something happens Legend of Zelda and they bring it up in the chat, it was like, Oh, did you find this thing? Oh, did you get this thing? Oh, what about this thing? And it's just like, there's so many different crazy things that happen. And it's just, it, oh my god, that game is everything. <laughs> Oh man, I was gonna play Ocarina of Time first, then Breath of the Wild, but I was like, screw it, I'm gonna play Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh my god. That's what's up though, dude. I'm glad, I'm really glad you're enjoying it, man. Alright, here we go. We'll do, let's see, it's 9.15 right now. Well, 9.12 my time. So, we'll do one more stage. I just wanted to show you guys a little bit of, um, oh my gosh graceful explosion machine and uh you know if you guys want to see more definitely uh give me the heads up i'll post a breakout video of this over on youtube and uh we'll do one more and then we'll take a quick break so that way jojo can stretch because he's an old fart and um we'll jump into i am setsuna boom, boom, boom. come on all right this is the one where we don't die we cannot die Mainly because I don't want to die and look like a fool again. Ah, uh, suck it. There we go. Mother lover. Oh, oh, I forgot I had the sword. Where did the sword come from? Oh, okay, I see what's going on here. All right. Powers on the left side resemble my X, B, A, Y buttons. That's what it is. Okay. Boom. Oh, wrecking shop. Okay, here we go. That's what it's about. Now JoJo's got a full arsenal. Let's do this. Nope, 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 nope. Why, 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 why? Awesome. Oh, my goodness. We're learning. And I like that there's like certain weapons that are more effective on enemies than others. And then there's weapons that just don't work on enemies. I like that. It adds a little bit of difficulty to it. And this is a total scoreboard game. <laughs> uh, there we go. This is a total leaderboard game is what I meant to say. What the hell is going on there? What's that sound? And boom, missiles, hell yes, yeah, see, it's clicking. It is clicking. I'm get. I'm understanding, I'm learning the powers of the Jedi. No longer am I a Padawan. Ah, uh, look at that, look at that. Suck it, everybody. All you space aliens, you're gonna get a solar beam. Cause I'm a Bulbasaur, yeah. And I totally died. I said we weren't gonna die and I died. As for me acting a damn fool. <coughs> Excuse me. Everyone go to the corner. And, and I looked at the chat box and that's what I get. Totally what I get. Ah. Where? Where was the thing? Where was the thing? I'm sorry, but... There was no thing there for me to get hurt by. I'm sorry, that just doesn't exist. <sighs> there we go. Alright, that was just plain recklessness. Now we really can't die. <laughs> there we go. Oh, we got one more phase after this. I forget I can dash, too. That's my own fault. Build up the meter, use them, use things accordingly. The good thing is I can dash through enemies, so I don't need to necessarily dodge my way over. No power, no power, no power! 
Uh, oh no. Okay, I'll come back to that guy. Let's build up meter. It's Street Fighter all of a sudden. Oh, come on, dude. Really? Stupid jerk. There we go. I knew that was the last one. I was like, it's gonna complete the phase afterwards. Eating chili fries. What? I want chili fries. Chili fries. A chili cheese dog from Papaya Dog sounds amazing right now. That used to be, like, the perfect food to have after, like, a long night out. <laughs> I don't know if there's a Papaya Dogs where you guys are at, or Papaya King, whichever you prefer. Whichever one claims to be the real one. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay, we we have a lot of things happening here. Excuse me. Oh, I don't know where that came from. Oh no! <laughs> don't be a jerk to me now. We can't die. We can't. No. Yes. <laughs> oh, we did it. We did it. We just made it. My goodness. Chemical warfare. What the hell did I miss? What? D plus. Why am I submitting that score? Oh, goodness. We got a check, check, a C, and a D plus. I can see how this game is going to go. I clearly need practice. But guys, that was Graceful Explosion Machine. Seems like this is more or less going to be the theme throughout the uh, game. You go through... Each world has a set amount of levels, so you can probably unlock most of the game without beating all the levels per stage. Look at that 19, which you can probably finish if I, you can probably unlock once you get through all of that and probably part of that. So yeah, four places here. I don't know if it, if it expands upon this, but uh, this is totally train ride game for me. This is like perfect, pick it up, Play it for a little bit, put it back in my backpack, go to work, go leave work, and then play it some more on the train ride. This is like quick in and out game. This is like perfect to play on Switch. So this is this is gonna be another one that's gonna consume my time. Ugh. Like I don't have enough things that consume my time, right? It's a good problem to have. It's a good problem to have. All right, so I think we're caught up on the chat. I think everyone's unhinged in the uh, <laughs> in the Twitch chat. It's actually hilarious. I love it. You guys keep it up. Um, when we return, we are going to start up. I am Setsuna, and uh, actually, you know what? I'll just have that ready to go in the background here. Um, actually, before we go on break, I want to show you guys something cool. So when you have more than 13 games, basically there's 12 blocks on this screen. Once you have more than that, you fill up the blocks, you get this uh, see all game screen, which I'll t you guys already know my qualms with, you know, not being able to have folders in this uh, on the Nintendo Switch. I'm sure it'll happen in, in an update somewhere in the future where they add folders. Don't know why that's not a thing now, but um, I, I'll accept this. I wish this could be the home screen if that's the case. Like, I can just do a see all games and have that there, but I mean, uh, whatever. It is what it is, but I thought that this was kind of a cool thing to show. You can't sort it out, though. There's no, like, sorting or anything, but um, I'll, I'll, I'll accept it. I'll allow it. I will allow it. So what do I want to do? I want to close out Graceful Explosion Machine, and we want to start up set I Am Setsuna, the theme that I have here, the layout that I've made here. So I'm going to leave this on the background. I'm going to go on break real quick. Um, just give me five minutes. Uh, I'm going to stretch a little bit and uh, see what's in the kitchen that I can grab. Because I am actually getting pretty hungry. Not going to lie. Not going to lie. And uh, <laughs> we'll be back with I Am Setsuna. So guys, hang tight. 
we're going for a break time. 